welcome back to my channel uh today we're doing a get ready with me simple makeup get ready with me uh just wanted to chill do like a simple makeup look so if you're a returning subscriber what's up guys how y'all doing and if you're new hi my name is angela i love everything disney and makeup is a hobby and if you want to see what I do when I get ready, then just keep on watching. I come and chill with you guys. Let's do a little get ready. It's currently 2.38. My daughter is sleeping. And sorry if you guys hear the noises again. Uh, I am recording with a phone. window open is right here. I'm using natural lighting and I'm using my phone. And uh, I don't have a mic i am trying to invest in one but i first want to invest in a camera uh, i do get tired of using my phone while I'm talking to you guys i should just start getting ready huh let's see how this goes because usually i do a get ready with me like a simple makeup look and it turns out to be like a glam af type of look so but yeah like i was saying sorry if you guys can hear a lot of background noise it's just that i'm filming with the camera and the camera's close to the window and a lot of cars pass by and stuff which kind of irritates me because sometimes motorcycle people come by and like they disturb my daughter's sleep my daughter is asleep right now um, excuse the hair I'm gonna fix it too <laughs> and so um you hear everything and you're probably hearing the wind as well but I can't do anything about that this is my filming setup for now. I recently posted a brow tutorial, mini tutorial on Instagram. I'll leave the link below, but it's quick and easy. It's like my everyday brow routine. I don't go glam AF all the time, so I'm using Everything that I use is going to be listed down below. Just in case I forget. So, well, how y'all been, guys? How was your weekend? How uh, if, are you guys out of school yet? I know some of you guys are probably out already, graduated, and everything. So, how is your summer? going since it's technically your summer already I'm actually dreading summer because I hate summer I dislike the heat for some reason like I prefer it to be cold as fuck um why because I don't sweat. I hate sweating, especially in between my thighs. Like, if you're a thick some girl, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, you shaft really easily around your thigh area. And that shit hurts, man. It hurts. You get all these like little bumps. So I just use this and sometimes I'll use my fingers but I'm going to use a brush right now. Are any of you now into matcha? You know, it's like this new thing now. Um, I actually like it. I think it's pretty good. It's you can drink it every day because regular green tea is actually bad for you to drink every goddamn day. If you guys didn't know that, um, you end up losing like a lot of electrolytes and stuff. So it's very bad for you. But this matcha is like good for you to drink when every day but 
it's like everyone and their mom is drinking it i'm drinking it my husband was like you and your matcha that's loca i'm like what the if he knows i love green tea so i don't know what so surprising for him about it i'm mainly drinking it because it's part of my diet so to say um it helps you lose weight as well if you're trying to lose weight i'm just gonna use this as a current there as well hi that big button i know i look a little crazy but this is what i do for a natural makeup day so <laughs> so i'm going in with my professional that's part of my project pan now if you guys haven't seen that video i'll link it around here um i'm excited to be doing a project pan because it makes me go through my collection oh and by the way spoiler spoiler alert for the next update one of my blushes from that elf palette broke <sighs> i got so pissed when that happened and then i had to repress the other one i got so mad because i was like it's part of my project plan and i feel like that's cheating mm. oh so pissed i was like are you serious i really wanted to see if i want i could finish it And it's never gonna happen. This I got in my Ipsy bag a long time ago. And I love using it. Like it's part of my project pen too. Anything with like the scotch tape is part of my project pen. I'll sharpen it really soon. I know I'm going like everywhere, but trust me, it's gonna be fine. So we're gonna use the peach sweet peach palette by Too Faced. So we're gonna go in with peaches and cream kind of set everything going in with my mermaid brush oh my god guys so i finally joined boxycharm i've been wanting to join boxycharm for like a while now and um i just didn't know if it was the right time yet I was waiting for like something awesome to come out I guess which this time it did uh, the Alomar palette Alomar cosmetics palette is in this month's boxycharm and it's a Latina owned brand so I'm all about it and this month it comes with six items in the box we're gonna go in with Georgia It comes with like six items this month and I'm all for it. Putting it in my crease. So from what I've seen so far, it's um it's the palette, it's a full size palette. It's lashes, uh luxie brushes. Uh, bum bum cream by Sol de Janeiro which I've always wanted to try if you guys have tried it let me know um, but I've always wanted to try it because I've heard a lot of good things about it and apparently supposedly it firms your bum bum or your ass <laughs> uh, yeah it's, it's for your ass I don't know what it's supposed to do exactly but it's like the big thing right now well, not right now, but it's apparently good. I'm going to go with Bellini. It's this color right here. It's right. It's this one. Pop that into my eyelid using my finger. And I'm going to wet my finger with the Tarte Ready Set Radiant Spray from my Project Pan too. You guys can tell. Um, but yeah, and it's also coming with an Ofra liquid lip. 
and an eyeliner. So, so far, the liquid lip eyeliner, palette, bum bum cream, the Luxie brushes, and the lashes. Yep, that's six items. I'm so excited. And, you know, that's a good way to grow your makeup collection if you're like a beginner. That's how I started growing my collection was um, subscribing to subscriptions like that. I started off with Ipsy for like a good year and a half or two. I started when I was living in LA, downtown LA. Um, and even living here, I had it, but then I canceled it because I started getting tired of getting repeated items and I was just not here for it. I was just tired of getting repeats. Um, I see a lot of people still enjoying it, but it's just not for me anymore. So I did. I decided to like stop getting it because to me it sucked. Plain and simple, it sucked. I was just like, you know what? I'm just gonna cancel it. Um, that's ten bucks I can be saving, and but it did help me. I'm not gonna lie. It did help me grow my collection a little bit and I'm not mad at it you know it, it helped me it, it opened my eyes to trying new stuff granted yeah some things aren't available at Sephora or Ulta they're more ending brands but it was good you know I had it lasted good and now I want to try something else and here comes BoxyCharm. I've wanted to try BoxyCharm and Ipsy together, but I just financially couldn't do it all at the same time. We're doing foundation. I'm always using the Wet and Wild one. Today, we're going to switch it up. Have my little... I put three pumps because I can. And I just grab it from here. My Fenty foundation, you guys know I love this. In 310, I usually go in with like a foundation brush. Like when I wear it outside of filming. But today, now. Nah. So yeah, I'm excited to get my box. It should be coming pretty soon I mean we're already like not midways of June but oh. we're like in the second week of June so it needs to get here already so I can try that palette that palette is what really called my name like you need this palette now for concealer, because I feel like I need it, I'm using the Tarte Shape Tape, and low-key, I kind of forgot what we are talking about before she was done. You guys can hear her. It's not her regular, and I'm using the Wet n Wild one too. It's not her regular time to be up she usually wakes up like around four so I have time to like you know do what I gotta do and if I have time to film I film so usually what I do is I dampen a little bit the uh, the, um, the blender beauty blender whatever I use I dampen it and then start blending out my concealer Yes, I do feel like that the tart shape, tart shape tape, can depending on how you do your skincare routine, right? Sometimes my under eyes can be dry. Sometimes um, there's days where it's like hella oily. 
then just grab the bottom part of it and just start blending out as well. Um, just depending on like the time of the month. Oh, I shouldn't be doing that there. Um, it can get really drying under the eye, so I use this. How rude. So I use this to help out with it not being as dry. So before my daughter woke up, I forgot what we were talking about, but um, what are your guys' plans for this summer? It'll be hella hot. And I ain't trying to deal with the hotness. Like I said before, I hate hot. I prefer the cold. I prefer winter. My husband, um, he's all right with either or, but he's not like me. Like he's, his body is like already hot, just like my daughter's. So for them, either or is fine. <laughs> But for me, it's like, uh-uh. I prefer winter. I don't bake. I just press it in. I'm just getting ready for the day. Because I hate looking like dead during the day but sometimes I have no time to like actually get ready like this so when I get the opportunity to do it I, I it looks like I go full glam but I don't it's just a little bit of here a little bit of there so for the rest of my face I'm going in with the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Finishing Powder because it's really good. I'll just go in with this Elf's Moss Dipple Brush. I've had this for years, guys. Like, y'all don't understand how long I've had it for. Just lightly going everywhere. And then because I do feel a little powdery, I'm going in with my Pixie Makeup Fixing Mist. Just like that. I love that smell, but sometimes I feel like this gets me super dewy. So I have to go in with the Kat Von D one. I, I love it, but... So now we're going in first with highlighter. I'm going in with the Mega Glow Highlighter and Crown on my Canopy by Wet n Wild and I'm taking my no, it's good. my Luxie 660 Precision Foundation Brush I use it for this it's super pretty I'm gonna go in with my Ofra uh, blush Topper and go on top of that too. When I'm at home, I do love to glow. That is one thing I love to do. I'll bring it down a little bit here because it is supposed to be like a quote unquote blush, but I use it for like a blush topper and it's part of my project pan too. So, okay, so that is done. Now, I'm going in with my Marc Jacobs Kink and Kisses. Uh, I haven't used this in a while. Like, like I barely use it. So when I want to use it, I go ham with it. It's a really nice flush of color. Perfect for the summertime too. See? It gives you that nice, like, blushed look to your cheeks now spoil alert spoil alert <laughs> i'm not i'm just not even going to <laughs> um but yeah that's what happened to it but it's all good it's all good it's still usable and i replaced 
one of them, so. We have a bronzer. How many of you are doing a summer project pen? Because I want to start one for the summer to see how much I can progress. Oops. I can progress with um, some items for the summer. How many items do you guys pan when it comes to the summer? Um, is it five, ten? Because I I want to do it. I really do. I really want to do it. But I just don't know how much to start with. Um, just gonna. I'm just gonna wear a lip balm today. Some around here. I'm gonna just use. Like, do you guys get to, like, uh, like, do you guys progress the same or less when you guys do a summer project pan compared to, like, a yearly one? Here, my daughter. I want to get to use a lot, but I don't know. I know I'm just rambling at this point. So I'm going to go in with... The Marc Jacobs Highliner in pink of me. On my waterline, I'm just gonna do mascara. I hate crying. Like, have you guys ever had that where you barely put on your your lip, your eyeliner, and then your eyes start watering? I hate that. Like. Stop it. <laughs> okay, let's see. So we're going in with like a pencil brush. We're going in with Peaches and Georgia. The colors we used in our crease. So we're going in with both this time. Might not be able to see it, but... This palette... It's so good, but I barely get to use it. And this is why I wanted to start a project pan for the summer because I want to use this palette and at least pan like a couple of these colors. And maybe I'm gonna go with a little bit of summer yum, like just tap it and go out here. on the outer part of my eye. Okay. Now in the corner highlight. I'm going in with the highlighter we use. It's going with my sample size of this Lights Camera Lashes by Tarte. I got it with my lash curler. And I love that lash curler. Alright, so now a final mist. Liquid lip or no liquid lip? How about a gloss? I've been into this one gloss. This is the only gloss I've been into and it's the Buxom's Lip Cream in Rose Julep and it's part of my project pen as well. So I'm just gonna line my lips with this NYX Crayon and Mauve and alright I'm just gonna fix my hair real quick you guys know I love my messy ass hair alright guys so there you go I don't know what to do with my hair I'm just gonna keep it this messy I don't care <laughs> uh, so there you guys go it's a quick get ready with me for the rest of my day. I wanted to feel a little, you know, pretty for today. Even though it's like late in the day. I swear we have like the latest start ever. My husband works nights. Well, middays. 
Middays for us, nights for where he works at. And so we keep our schedule with his. So this is technically like our morning slash afternoon already. So I end up washing this off like around 10. So it's three, so four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, like seven hours of wear, which is fine with me. Um sometimes I have to go do like a quick run to the market. So I want to look awake and this is what I do most of the time. So this is me ready for my day. Now this is how it is. And if you guys liked it, give it a thumbs up guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys have a wonderful day rest of the week or rest of the weekend for whenever you're watching this Rude. and i will see you guys until next time bye lovelies